Have you ever looked inside of a messy PC case with wires going everywhere and wondered, is there a better way? This is the JHack M2426, and maybe for you, it is a better way, because although this looks like a tiny Pico power supply, it's really a power cable. It does do some things that a Pico power supply does. It takes 12 volts in and turns it into 5 volt and 3.3 volt, but it's mainly meant to take a breakout cable, such as this, which plugs into your power supply, plug into either side, and pass 12 volts to your motherboard, and 5 volt and 3.3 volt. But it also will output 12 volt through the other side. And again, these are interchangeable, so you can power your CPU 4 plus 4 pin, or design a different cable and plug it into a low power GPU. Now, of course, my main use case is for the Skyreach 4 Mini. More and more of my customers are wanting to do brickless builds with more and more powerful graphics cards, which are getting more and more bigger. That's a problem. So there's two main methods to doing a brickless build at the moment. If you want a tutorial on how to do those, then check out my playlists where I put lots of content that I don't advertise to YouTube because I'm not a YouTuber. I'm supported by Patreon. This makes the B method much simpler. The B method is when you put the AC-DC portion of the power supply in front of your motherboard and the DC-DC portion on the side of your graphics card. This is easy for the customer to do, but you have to put a bunch of ugly cables all going over your mini's parts, and nobody wants that. This product solves that problem. I kind of loosely placed them here in the video reference, that's just for you to see how it works, but obviously there's a lot less cables. Now there is one more problem with the B method, and that is you need some ultra, ultra low profile PCIe power cables. Now I have a tutorial on how to make those, but they're kind of a pain in the butt. So I offer 180 degree connectors, which you can go buy on my website, usually. Anyway, this doesn't have to be a complicated video. It doesn't have to be a long video. I just want to introduce you to this handy little power cable so you can use it in your builds. If you have any questions, of course, ask them below in the comments. I will answer as best I can, and I'm sure that Mr. J Hack himself will be happy to answer your questions. You can check him out on his website here. It was great to be with you guys again. Thank you for watching this video, and I'll see you next time. Peace.